What is up guys, it's Mike, it's Mamo here, welcome to my YouTube channel, and most of all, welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of Baleard, the Servant, Baleard, the Servant, the Servant of Baleard, the Hashishim Dark Mage, and welcome to episode unknown, part 4, I believe, where we're gonna continue the search for the ancestor tombs, it could also be that we're part 5, I do not know, it's really confusing. But before we're gonna continue, uh, let myself get a drink, so one second. Alright, I'm back. So let's go to the next. Well done. Take that, rotten beast. to go all around here. Now I'm starting to believe that this one is fairing, but I'm not sure, it could also be this one. It's really confusing. Miserable beast.
miserable beast. Easy PC man. Game's not that heavy. I'll chop you to pieces. Oh no. Stop right there, I'll kill you. I hate those beasts. Let me first take the matter at hand, which is the uh, tomb. Oh, if you're gonna dig these treasures, make the sure to quick save afterwards. Because if you die, even if you did save before, you're gonna dig up the treasure. If you die, then it's bye bye the loot. You know, then it will say there's nothing there. So make sure to save every time you dig up. Some shit. Now we're near Faring, so the hardest one is always the one that I get at last, which is with the demon and the uh, sacrificial altar. Well done. Take that, rotten beast. Still need about thirty-five thousand for the uh Ashishin Elite armor, which will cost me about one hundred and forty thousand. Wait here. Alright, then I'll stay here. Make sure you to let your companion wait here. He might get bugged by getting up here. So just a precaution.
I need about 100 magic ore for a armor piece for one of the members of the fire clan. And I'm not quite sure if I need more ore than that, but plenty, that's for sure. Come with me, let's get to it. Indeed. Let's find some more orcs to bash. Yep, this is the one near uh, near Faring, I think. I don't know, it's really confusing. Everything in Nordmar looks look so much alike. Miserable beast. Now each region has their own, you know, supplies of ore, ma majority speaking. You know, in the Mir China it's iron ore, in Nordmar it's magical ore, and in the desert it's gold. Of course there is, you know, ore deposits spread it across the entire continent here and there, in mines and whatnot. But when it comes to the majority speaking ore deposits in each region it's iron ore in Myrtana magic ore in Nordmar and gold ore in Varant the treasure of the desert is gold Oh, this is the one with uh, near fairing. But it's nice because then I can have a uh, teleport point in order to get back to when it comes to supplying mana. Well done.
but before I TP, you know, I'm gonna make doubly shirts near fairing. When did I last save? Yeah, not gonna happen. Hey, you! What are you doing sneaking around? Come, let's get to it. I'm starting to think that this is the, uh, with the altar. Could be wrong, though. Like I said, it's so, you know, similar everywhere. Oh, no, this is most definitely the one near Faring. Just to first go to ferry. I need the uh, Nort Marion at ferry for one, and uh, two. I need. Where's my companion? I need to resupply on potions. All right, so let's wait here. All right, then I'll stay here. Let's quickly go by each uh, city with a known alchemist, and then uh, that one uh, I got killed. But at least I can use the alchemist bench. Now let me first go to the alchemist itself. See if I can get enough gold for the elite assassin armor. See if I can learn things and what have you. Show me your goods. Now getting the gold for the armor is not my pr top priority at the moment. But uh, getting supplies is so let me first resupply my supply and then I will see whether I do or do not have enough obviously for the elite armor of the Hashishin at least this guy has quite a bit of gold I might add now I don't need 111 ice wolf skins but I'm not quite sure how many I do need so I'm gonna keep them off now
show me your goods. Faring I have to go as the last galvanized alchemist. Now healing potion is already not necessary. I can also make them. So let me just get the supplies I need to make both healing and mana. But when it comes to buying potions, only mana. Show me your goods. Show me your goods. Show me your goods. Teach me something about alchemy. I'm thinking about where I should put my permanent potions. I think mana. Ah, uh, fuck it, I'm gonna invest in mana. I think I need about 250 mana, yeah. I want to poison weapons. First, you need a weapon and the poison. Avoid dunking the whole blade in the poison. Apply it in a thin coat only, on the edge and the tip, 
and make sure that you don't cut yourself. Alright, so alchemy for now is max. Now the reason why I'm not, you know, learning the arrows is because of the fact that this guy is really not using the bow as a uh, part of his build, but actually as a secondary option once his mana supplies are low. Now I've got plenty of mana potions right now, but should those, you know, especially early game, you have no much mana you don't have much skills when it comes to magical capabilities so you m must be dependent on somewhat of a long range capability which is why i take the bow because the crossbow requires training and the bow you get automatically you know uh, i do want to get home late smithing 33 reddick I don't have to supply myself anymore on mana potions, which is good. Teach me something about being a smith. How do I sharpen my blade? Go to the whetstone and let it rip. Slowly draw the blade from left to right and hone it evenly. That makes it nice and sharp. Show me how to forge a magic ore weapon. There isn't much to know. The principle is the same as in forging weapons. Heat the blank, work it, cool it. But of course, a magic ore weapon needs a magic ore blank. Would you teach me how to fight? You don't have the necessary experience. Oh, I effed it up. Well, it doesn't matter. Relatively close to leveling up. Alright, so let's quickly go to the Wolf Clan and deliver the pelts. Hammer Clan deliver the pelts, etc. And then uh, we're gonna continue. towards the ancestor's tomb with the uh Nord Marion from Faring. Kettle sent me. Yes, I know. He's waiting for the skins. What am I supposed to do? I don't have them. Tell him he'll get them just as soon as I have them. When will that be? No idea. Maybe it would be better if we got them somewhere else. I have skins here from Hansen. Ah, the Ice Wolf skins. I've been waiting for those. Wait, I've got something here for you. I have a couple of healing potions and a few mana potions. We traded for them at the monastery. I'd rather have gold. Here, that should be enough. Alright, so let's quickly go to the Hammer Clan. I think 
don't want to deal with smut. Food can do this much work. Rune doesn't have any pelts. Damn it. Stainar needs them badly. What about you? Could you get me the pelts? You don't look like a few buffalo skins would pose a problem for you. I would give you three extra lumps of ore. I will see what I can do. Here are your pelts. I hope you didn't have too many problems. Here's your ore. What about the bonus? It's yours. It's all yours. Here you go. How many magic ore do I have? 81, so not enough. quick save before I make any of those options. I want armor for myself. Fine. That will cost you 100 lumps of ore. Good wares don't come cheap. I need armor for Thoral. What size? He is big and fat. Hmm. I have some here. It's used, but it ought to fit. It's yours for 1,000 gold coins. I want to buy the armor for Thorald. Here is the gold. Here, all nicely packed up. So you can either pay with ore or pay with gold. Go for the gold one. It's easier to get 1000 gold than 100 magic ore nuggets. Um, Fire Clan. Here is your armor. Finally. What now? If you want me to, I will accompany you as long as you are in Nordmark. I'm looking for men. You found one. I want to free the mine of the Hammer Clan. I still need fighters. I'm in. I will follow you. Let's attack. Let's get to it then. Go on ahead. We'll meet at the assembly point. All right, so we're done here. Um, Faring, where are you? Oh, I almost forgot. I also wanted to go to Vanguard real quick to uh, pick up those uh, whetstones for the bonus strength. The more strength I have, the better. So I'm gonna take a little detour again. That's what you were always saying. But there is another problem. I don't know if you're right about that. I just have to find all those whetstones. There were th about four or five of them, if I remember correctly.
Also Montara has one. So I will quickly do these things and then uh, we're gonna go into the next episode. Even though I didn't do much when it comes to uh, the ancestor tombs, it's still part of that episode. But that's because, you know, the ancestor tombs require a lot of traveling. Now of course this is not connected to the ancestor tombs in any way. But I do need the extra stats. And I'd rather do them when I remember then, you know, forget to do them all together. found three so far so there should be at least one more at least as far as I can remember could be wrong though and uh, let's quickly go to Montera and then faring again and go to the North Marion I don't have access to the inner yard. I forget. Doesn't matter. Um, fairing it is. Let's go to the Note Marion and finish the episode there. Well, part of this episode, you know. The original plan episode. Well, I cannot go into the next episode until the Ancestor Tombs have been completed. Because otherwise, you know, you get episode 1, episode 2, episode 3. E even though it's the same episode, basically, or the same part of the episode. Most Let's Play just give one episode 1, episode 2, you know. Could that, I could do that too. But I prefer a bit more organized method. Like, you know, Vanguard part 1, part 2, part 3, part 4, part 5 maybe. Maybe not, it depends. And, you know, then episode 3, 4, 5, each area, a different episode. If you're in the area, different parts of that particular episode. That's just my cup of tea, you know. And anyways guys, I wanted to thank you guys for watching, if you like what you see, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified on whenever I upload. And I hope to see you guys in the next part, where we most likely are gonna finish the Ancestor Tombs, I need to do this one, which is um, where I'm at now, you know, I will walk with the guy towards here, and then this one is the harder one too you know get access to but we will get there nevertheless thank you guys for watching and hope to see you guys next time